This is MSJ Chem. In this video, I'll be looking at the energy content of carbohydrates and lipids. Carbohydrates and lipids are both used for energy storage in the human body. On the left, we have the structure of the monosaccharide glucose, which is a carbohydrate. On the right, we have the structure of a triglyceride, which is formed from a glycerol backbone and three fatty acids. Gram for gram, lipids provide more energy than carbohydrates. In lipids, the ratio of hydrogen to oxygen is greater, which means they are more reduced than carbohydrates. Therefore, when they are oxidized, lipids release more energy than carbohydrates. Next, we will compare the solubility of carbohydrates and lipids. Glucose, like all monosaccharides, is soluble in water. It has polar OH groups that form hydrogen bonds with water molecules. Fats, on the other hand, are insoluble in water. That's because they have non-polar hydrocarbon chains. Because they are soluble in water, carbohydrates are more rapidly transported in the body and are used for short-term energy supply. Because they are insoluble in water, fats are more slowly transported in the body and are used as long-term energy storage. So to summarize, lipids provide more energy than carbohydrates because they are more reduced and they are also insoluble in water.